Hey, what's up guys? It's Black Sheep and it's a Saturday. I just got back from DMP Sports Cards in Sacramento, got a box of Heroes and Prospects. Hopefully you watch that break. Um, I'll do a little recap here as well, but I'm also going to be doing a contest video to announce the contest that I'm going to be having for that product. So uh, look out for that contest, I guess, at the end of this video. Um, I did want to say that I did participate in a group break at DMP Sports Cards, and uh, the group break was a random team one and it was I think sixteen dollars a spot for four box breaks of artifacts and I went to DMP Sports Cards and picked them up and I'll show you what I got. I got one card that I think was pretty good and so uh, here we go first of all I had Buffalo and Anaheim one of the cards I got was this Tyler Myers numbered 66 of 99 emerald version uh, he did throw in the base so Tyler Ennis a couple of those Derek Roy uh, Tyler Myers regular base. Also got a Cam Fowler and two George Perro space cards. Awesome. And uh, the two big cards actually, one's not that big, but um, one is a tandem, a Tundra tandems of Ryan Getzlaff and Bobby Ryan. So I got that jersey card, definitely for trade, as I am definitely not a Ducks fan. And speaking of George Perros, you saw a couple of those. I actually ended up getting a really nice George Peros card. Number 12 of 15, dual patch of George Peros. Can I get a close-up on those patches? Just really nice patches. There is a little bit of a corner shoe. There it is. I think hopefully you can see that. A little bit of a ding in the corner. But um, if you are a Ducks fan and uh, you like any of these cards, let me know. They are available for trade, and again, the Peros is really nice, but there is a little bit of a cornering issue on that one. Um, in case you didn't see the box break, or if you skipped it, or you're watching this video first, I'm going to do a little review of the cards that I got in there. I thought it was a really good box, actually. I got this Justin Bailey autograph, a Ryan Culkin autograph, Stefan Matteau autograph, and uh, this Matthew Dumba game use number silver version really cool piece in there you can see the seams stitching and um, three colors with a hint of white there on the side and it is a silver version I looked it up on the website there's only three of these so it's limited to three so really nice card Matthew Dumba and this really nice card of Nathan McKinnon um, he's actually a really, uh, I guess, highly sought after and prospected guy. Really, he might even be number one next year in the draft, or in this year's draft, I should say. Who knows? But I know that he is a very high prospect, so really cool to get this card. Really happy to get that one. Okay, well, anyways, let me, um, let me do this. Zoom over here. This is my review of Heroes and Prospects. As usual, if you don't mind, read the review and go to the comment section and write me a comment. And let me know what you thought of Heroes and Prospects this year. I thought it was actually a really great product. But let me know what you thought of my review or the product itself, and you could win a card from my break. Here's my date and time. Let's have this contest end Saturday the 2nd. Let's have it end Thursday the 7th, Thursday, the 7th of February. So that's when the contest will end. I'll do a random drawing either that day or a, sometime after that day um, for, for some cards from that break. Okay, so hopefully you guys will have fun with that. I'd love to read your comments and see what you thought of Heroes and Prospects this year. I think it's great, but let me know what you think and if you've seen anything great come out of it. Thanks for watching, guys. And, oh, before I go... I'm going to give you a hint of tomorrow's retail review. So here it is. I'm going to slowly do this. There. Oh, I think I gave too much of it away. There it is. That's what you're going to see tomorrow. Thanks, guys. Hopefully you got that. See you next time.